We're back in Leger. It's round two of the UCI Downhill World Cup. We're on the track walk. We're going to kick things off and check out this new track here in Leger. Kick things off. New jump here. Oh, step gun. Oh, it looks quite gnarly actually. The chain is not going to be coming off with this microphone. But the track is off the chain. Off the chain. The uh, classic French World Cup track, the grass wide open, sets up the uh, top section for us here in Leger. They're not too worried about the people that have to go around the jumps, they've just let them go through the bush, so uh, yeah. Don't go through the bush. Bit like the Surrey Hills, I think. Surrey Hills. Surrey Hill conditions. Bit of Bernard. We've got a big dog road gap. After the gnarly off camber section, um, it's looking quite scary actually. There's going to be plenty of mud dogs this week. Uh, Jamie, what do you think of the uh, track so far? Looks good. Looks pretty fast until this section. And, and then tricky. And then very tricky, very quickly. Yeah. Hopefully it doesn't get too soft. What do you reckon the road gap? It'll go. Big dog. Bit of, bit of commitment needed, I think, but it should yeah. be good. First run challenge? Maybe. Maybe, <laughs> maybe. maybe I run up first, see how soft it is. Make sure it's good? Yeah. Not a, not a first run guy? Mm, no, maybe. We'll see. Worked out this road gap is about three Jules's high. My cameraman Jules is about, about three of him. One, two, three. Three Jules's is good size, good size. Not bad. Good size. The most sporty team in mountain biking, Team Visor. You don't want to do an interview? No. Oh, why, not? why not? My English is too bad. No, it's good. Your brother is okay? Yeah, not too bad, but he needs to stay at the hospital for the moment mm -hmm. for checking and uh, yeah, for checking. checking. Yeah. <laughs> but it's a shame that he's not here and uh, we wish him all the best. Yeah, yeah. Because Amory, without this race, is almost, yeah. you know, it's missing. Yeah, yeah. for sure. But uh, yeah, how are you doing? And uh, you came from the French Cup? Yeah, good track, yeah. yeah. Uh, pretty pff, low arm section, yeah. pretty fast. It was a good race. Good preparation for yeah. this one? For sure. Yeah. <laughs> and the visor is looking speedy. Uh, you're, 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 yeah, oh, good at all, mate. There we go, team visor. <laughs> good. I'm team visor. <laughs> What's with the visor? It's just a new thing for the team. Yeah. Yeah. We like it. Like to look sporty. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, good luck this weekend, mate. Thank you. You Cheers. too. Cheers. Sick McKenna, how many spots for no handers is there so far down this course? Let me think. Maybe two. Two. <laughs> yeah. The big road gap. There's a triple step down up here. Might be able to pull one oh. off. Yeah. <laughs> That'll be a, quite a gnarly one. Bit of a natural landing, but. <laughs> yeah. The natural no hander. I remember from the Invitational last year, you got a bit of hang time there, so. Oh, really? Yeah, it might be good. So you were at the Invitational last year. How much has it train changed so far? Yeah, it's pretty similar. The top is a bit different, mm -hmm. and then but once we got into the woods, it's basically the same layout. They just made it straight this year. Right, straighter. There, there was more turns last year. Right. Yeah. Is that a good or a bad thing? Uh, long as it points downhill, I'm happy. <laughs> you don't want to go up. <laughs> yeah, no. Nah. You're not enduro yet. Uh, I don't know. If I spent a whole winter training for it, maybe. No enduros this year. Yeah. Next Racing. Oh, he's racing next week. Mega Avalanche next week. Oh, yeah. well, that's know. pretty enduro. It'll go uphill at one point. It's pretty enduro, yeah. It's not full enduro, though. Oh, I forgot him on mask for half oh. the video. Anyway, Dakota, what do you think of the track here in Leger? Oh, it looks sick. Seems pretty fresh, so I'm sure it's going to change a lot, but I'm excited to get my wheels in this dirt. And a few senders up there, you're going to send it? Uh, I think there's some big senders. You know, the road gap looks pretty big, and that section before, I think you're going to be cooking through there. Mm. So, yeah, I think it looks awesome, man. So far, I'm stoked. It's going to be a good day. Just going to send her. Ah, yeah, maybe a little bit of that. Can't, can't get too out of control. Yeah, yeah. You end in that berm, there's going to be a problem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think but, there could be some people in the berm. I think that there may be some people over the berm, landing past the berm. Oh. <laughs> and they just announced a double race at Snowshoe. You must be excited about that one. Ooh, you know, that's going to be pretty gnarly. I think the schedule looks a little bit better for this one, so I'm excited about having two at home. I mean, you don't live in West Virginia, but... I mean, there will be people yelling, and it's going to be loud. So it was be, sick last time. It will be a good time. I mean, I hope the same for this weekend as well. All right. Thanks, mate, and good luck this weekend. Thank you so much, you too. Mike Jones, uh, you returned to World Cup racing. What do you think of the track here in Leger so far? Yeah, it's good. I think um, we've been waiting for something like this for a long time at World Cup, so it's nice to be back, and I'm looking forward to it. Not on a team this year? Nah, no team this year. 
this whole COVID thing messed up and obviously with teams and that stripping budgets and making teams smaller I just thought I'd just do my own thing for a year and see what happens and hopefully get back in another one next year go for the privateer award then hopefully if I'm allowed it yeah depends how pro you are <laughs> there's no pro in this team mate <laughs> all right well I like it yeah that's what we're looking for yeah, nice. Good luck this weekend, mate. Cheers, mate. All right, Aaron, uh, here in Leger, had a couple of weeks at home in the US. Uh, how are you feeling? Good, man. Yeah, we had a couple of good weeks. Um, did a pretty decent amount of riding at home, and the weather was good. And yeah, it was a really solid couple of weeks, so I'm stoked to be back. And uh, just walked probably half the track. What do you think? It looks good. I've uh, never raced here before, so it's all oh. kind of new to me, but um, it looks good. It's kind of a mixture of a bunch of different stuff it reminds me of out of soul in some spots and yep. like just uh i think it'll be good there's gonna be a lot of lines i think cutting in tomorrow and depending on if it's wet or dry i think that'll really determine like how difficult the track is if it's wet i think some of those sections gonna be really hard and if yep. it's dry you're gonna be kind of be able to go wherever you want so yep. um it looks good man cool track a lot of fresh sections really wide a lot of lines kind of everything i like how do you approach the track walk if if you can't really see the lines at the moment um just try to figure out lefts and rights i think and any like big hucks that you don't want to roll off blind first run <laughs> that road gap <laughs> yeah that road gap was sketchy yeah so uh, yeah nothing crazy just kind of figure out the general flow and then i think probably stop tomorrow first run and kind of see how it's cutting in all right well good luck this weekend and have a good one thanks bro cheers mate this looks like a gnarly Malali territory in these conditions, mate. It does. Yeah, it looks like that uh, US Open we did a couple oh, of years no, ago. Yeah. The sections look kind of similar yeah. when we first went there as well. Yeah, yeah, it's all fresh and soft, and yeah. it's going to look completely different after bikes go on the trail. And it's just going to get rutted and all sorts. Yeah, I think it'll be cool. Hopefully it'll be a lot of line choice. What do you think of the track, Joe? Uh, I think it looks very exciting so far. Like, there's kind of, as you can see, it's real slimy on top, but we know there's so many routes underneath. So I think it's going to change massively tomorrow morning. It's going to become really technical. I think we're due rain all week. So, yeah, it's going to be pretty full on, I think. But I like it. Yeah. And tire choice, what would you go for? Definitely the uh, the full spikes to start with, I think. Mm. Judging off what we're seeing right now, you're going to need all the all the brake and the grip you can. Yep. Get the mud dogs out. Yeah, mud dogs out in the fucking ground, baby. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Sven's doing two jobs. What do you think of the track, mate? You know what, I'm very disappointed we don't have those old school outdoor moto, Leger, yeah. Fabian versus Nico versus Steve P turns. But you can't talk shit on this track. It looks pretty fucking good. Who's your picks for the weekend? I'm with Freon. He's uh, at hospital. He's my pick on this track always. Well, we have to say, get well soon, Amory. Yep. Um, but in reality, uh, Loic secret, secretly like relieved, but then Loris is um, stealth master. You see how fast Loris, uh, Loic was going on that clip he put from Morgens, and then Loic was just free wheeling behind him and just holding him. Exciting. So they're just playing games with each other. It's too easy to say the French though, although we're in France. Oh. Yeah. Danny's name came up. Danny is actually probably the guy. All right, Danny, you've been here in Morzine for a week or so. Can we not just race down some of the single tracks in Morzine? Yeah, it would be good, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah. You've lapped out the single tracks in Morzine. You like them? Just one or two, yeah. Got got to know a couple and... They're pretty good, aren't they? I went yeah. yesterday and I was like, well, I should have stayed longer. Yeah. But I was at the Enduro, so, yeah. What do you think to this? It looks uh, pretty wild, to be honest. Could get interesting, couldn't it? Yeah. There's a couple of... Uh, Dicey sections up there. There is, yeah. All action, no traction. I'll have traction. Hey, one thing, one <laughs> thing right. going back. Confident. To, going back to Danny. Yep. Um, when he won, I just looked at all those World Champs photos at the beginning of the year. Mm. He was the only one that stuck to all his inside lines in um, Champery when it was wet. On that big berm in the open, yeah. the one before, the berm before Sam crashed, yeah. he was still inside. And there's chicane where Maddie crashed or some broke his yeah. wrist or Leo broke his wrist. That chicane, just before he got in the final woods, he's the only one that held his double inside. So, so just hold the inside lines, Sven saying basically ride like you did in 2011 and you'll probably win the race. Thing is, in 2011, you could find grip in places, whereas. It's gonna be it's gonna be tricky down there. Yeah, yeah. Like Champry was like quite hard packing places, and you're just riding in a river. How much faster would you be or slower on the giant glory of 2011? What he had done this now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did sit on the old bike before, and it wasn't too bad. Really? But my new bike is far better. Of course. Obviously. Yeah. <laughs> but um, a 26-inch wheels would it make a difference? Oh, I don't even know when. <laughs> I, have, I haven't got a technical enough answer yeah, for yeah. you. We'll have to try one day, you know. <laughs> One day when we're retired, 
Yeah. We can race yeah, each other yeah. on old bikes. Yeah, we can. We've got the a bit vintage of downhill. That's what class. that's yeah. what retired riders do. They race vintage. <laughs> We've got a bit of a backup here. We should crack on. All right. Well, sorry about the traffic jam. <laughs> No, nah, there's not there's too much grip for us. This is just gripping. <laughs> See? Too easy. The new Nikes have got way too much traction. Hey, show us the sign. Yeah. So where's the gate gonna be? Voila, I don't know yet. Where will be the gate? Maybe a little Down further. Here. No, I'm not sure. Alright. The yeah. gates of hell. <laughs> Sounds like a good section. I probably would be talking loud if I just won the World Cup though. <laughs> maybe, maybe and had the leaders jersey Sick. the swiss national jersey and yeah. european championships jersey yeah yeah that's sick so it's gonna be hard to keep the three yeah. jersey this year or the four with the yeah. leader jersey but i'm gonna give my best and see well you have currently all the jerseys you could have you couldn't have any more jerseys yeah and the uh, number one plate in yellow which oh. i think it's so amazing so yeah. the dream the dream. Who would the who dream. would have expected that? <laughs> not even myself. I don't know. <laughs> so I don't know who else will believe in me like that. But not even yourself. No, I don't think. No, oh. honestly, no. Too but fast. Um, Too fast to have everything together. Like it's just a dream. I'm living a dream. Yeah. Well, it's got to be a good one. Yeah. Really. Yeah. Super one. I hope it keeps yeah. that way. <laughs> and the, you've walked most of the track here in Leger. What do you think? It looks sick. Really, yeah. like, yeah. Proper gnarly. Proper down the track with many lines, um, steep, big jumps. So far, it looks amazing. Can't yeah. wait. Excited for this one, then? Yeah, really excited. All right. Well, good luck this weekend, and uh, yeah, don't get too drunk for the interview. <laughs> yeah, I'll try next time. <laughs> All right, cheers. Valley, what do you think of the track so far? It looks pretty sick. Some parts remem remind me a bit of Leo Gang, but <laughs> it's, ah. got, it's going to be good. Yeah. So that's a good thing then? It's fun because you have some parts where you really can go fast and then it's really technical and slow at the same time and then fast again. So it's going to be interesting who can like keep it together. Fired up for it then? Definitely, yeah. Especially after the last race. Um, <laughs> went down in flames in that last corner. Up for some redemption? Well, I'm not sure what you're talking about, but <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, I'm pretty happy right now about my riding, so we will see. All right, fired up then. Thank you. Good luck this weekend. Thank you, you too. Lomers. To get down here. Walking. Walking will be harder. Oh, look, they're up. You have a few podiums, eh? Yep. How many podiums? Wow, what we were. <laughs> you doesn't even, be, you're going to hit that and you're going to literally stay on the tape. Doesn't even line you up. You're good for the race yeah. this, this weekend? Uh, yeah, Feeling strong? Yes, you're yeah, very strong. Okay, good luck. <laughs> Thank you. Fresh rig for Reese, uh, the green gold. What do you think of the track, mate? Yeah, I really like the track. It's uh, probably the best one I think that's going to be this season. It's super quick, super fresh, yeah. kind of similar to what I ride at home. So super looking forward to it with all the fresh loam. It's going to be good. Looks full on the whole way down and line oh, yeah. choice everywhere. Yeah, it's super wide. Yeah. It's going to be I'm really looking forward to this. Super quick, so good. All right, exciting one then. Yeah. Good luck this weekend, mate. Yeah, thank you. Cheers. You too. Cheers, dog. Are you a mud dog? I'm a dog, but a nice dog. In the mud? I'm a gentle dog. Gentle dog. Gentle dog. And what do you reckon of the track, mate? For oh, that's... Is that uh, Cinder Billy or is that Cinder Billy? Uh, I'm, I'm not really Cinder Billy right now. So, some uh, some uh, other fasted guys on yes. my place, more than me. But really? uh, yeah, now I'm happy that the track is really cool. It's just, uh, they tape it super large, it's super flow, like any like tight corner. Mm. And uh, it should be a, such a good week. I hope the weather will stay the same. No, 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 we like <laughs> dry <laughs> sand, please. <laughs> I'm tired uh, to rush the bike and the stuff <laughs> yeah. after the race. But now you have a big truck, so you look like yeah. a boss. Yeah, so now uh, I'm like home, you know, I yeah. can sleep, I can uh, have rest and stuff. That's so cool. Should be a good week for sure. All right, good luck and I hope Cinder Billy comes out on Saturday. Yeah, I hope too. Cinder Billy is the, is the plan. Cinder Billy. Cinder Billy. <laughs> Looks fucking scary. <laughs> At least someone's honest. Yeah, uh, lots of routes, a lot going on, a lot of new sections, so yeah. don't really know how all of it will work, but it's going to be a challenge, I think. Hard one to walk and then work out what's even, even going on. Yeah, I kind of gave up after halfway. Like, <laughs> There's like no ruts yet, so 
you can't even see the roots yet, so I think it'll change a lot tomorrow. So excited, then? Yeah, excited, a little nervous. I think it's <laughs> it's kind of sketch. I think yeah. some bits. So and there's a um, lot going on the whole way down. Yeah, the whole way. No easy section really. So yeah, it's going to be exciting. <laughs> yeah. All right, Greg. Uh, here in Leger, what do you think of the track? Yeah, I think it's cool. Yeah. Um, it's been a long time that we've had pretty raw track yeah. with so many options. Yeah. And good options. I think the organizers did a really good job at like looking at how the riders would ride it and, and then giving lines that aren't like unrealistic. You know, there's there's a couple good options in there. Yeah. Plenty of lines the whole way down pretty much. Yeah, for sure. So, Except that last shoot. I mean, that's going to be so gnarly, but one deep rut yeah. or slimy rut. Yeah, yeah. And uh, the race within the race, you versus uh, your fellow countryman, Teo Langson. Now, how are you feeling coming into this one? Yeah. He's really thrown it out there, but um, I mean, it's just like any other race. I've come to race the World Cup and, you know, we'll see at the end. <laughs> but I hear there's $100 on the line. Yeah, you know, he, uh, he wanted to do some tattoo stuff. Or, I'm, I'm not so sure, but maybe $100 is just simple enough. So, <laughs> Which currency are we going for? Well, dollar, not Zim dollar. We go US dollar. Yeah, yeah. We'll keep it simple. But, you know, that, that'll be kind of fun. I mean, um, <laughs> it's a race within a race. So. Yeah. You know, once we get through qualies, we'll hope it'll be in the final together and then we'll see what happens. Well, yeah, it'll be a showdown. I'm looking forward to the race, Riven, the race. I was there for the action when it all went down, so uh, yeah, it's going to be exciting. <laughs> it's going to be a good one. And good luck this weekend, Greg. Uh, have a good one. Thanks for you too, bro. Cheers, mate. <laughs> all right, Kate, uh, the track here in Leger looks pretty exciting, mate. Yeah, man, wicked. Proper good. You've been uh, getting ready here in Morzine, so you must be excited for this one? Yeah, plenty of laps, plenty of laps, yeah. Very excited, very. Going to be some wild riding going on, flats or clips? I don't know. I, I'm thinking flats now, eh? Because mm. it's just, you're going to be feet off everywhere. You have to dab. Yeah, dab everywhere. Dab does save you in plenty of moments, and it yeah. looks like at the moment it's pretty slick up there. Yeah, very slick. I think, yeah, maybe flats, we'll see, eh? All right, that's the question. Yeah, that is the question. Yeah, Loris, your home race, uh, home World Cup. How are you feeling? Hungry? Yeah, no. Um, feeling good. Like we watch um, the track, we walk the track, yeah. and it was pretty gnarly. Like yeah. they tried hard, and if it stays like that, it's going to be really gnarly, but maybe fun. It's pretty straight too. Like yeah. it's not like really technical. It's just wah, da, da, da. Yeah. so maybe on the way it might be sketchy. On the drive it would be sick, but in between like mixed, excited and a little bit scared if it pulls like every day. I yeah, feel yeah, like yeah. it's gonna be wrecked and I'm uh, yeah need to figure out some things in the mud. So we'll see. Well, good luck this weekend and uh, do it for the French, mate. Yeah, do it for the French. All right. Yeah, for me. Thank you. All right. Well, that wraps up the track walk from here in Leger and it's looking like a proper gnarly one there's like nowhere really on this track we can chill and uh, a lot of lines you got to remember so i think it's going to be a good race come saturday we'll see you then it's going to be an exciting one we're missing amory piron and uh we've heard word that thibaut de Prella might be riding so we'll see you tomorrow fingers crossed for him but all, all the best amory and uh douglas vera get well soon as well cheers boys over and out from wind tv